Welcome back to Adventures with Tim. And I'm here with my Ford 2110 tractor. And last spring, I purchased a new attachment. So this is an everything attachments. Core aerator drum style, 72 inch. They did ship it to a freight depot near me and I'm going to give you a quick review today. So let's get to it. So, 72 inch, shipped out of North Carolina, made in the USA. The drum is actually filled with sand. I don't have to worry about that freezing in the winter. Being in uh, New England, that is a problem for me. Comes with these nice parking stands. Seems like my Speedco is not fitting quite right right now. But I think that will be that'll click right in as soon as I get going. For weight, it is sized for cinder blocks, but I am using uh, lead sheets because I have lead sheets. If you have them, use them. If you don't, use cinder blocks. Um, this thing is significantly heavy as it is, over 600 pounds. Um, I used it in the spring to core core aerate my yard. And it did an excellent job. But I wanted to wait until I actually thought about it long enough. Um, one thing I have found, you cannot turn with it. Being a drum, it is not independent any way around. So if you turn, one side will rip. Check out the final results here. Lots of holes. I mean, these plugs aren't 
great. But for dry ground, it'll do. Also, with the ag tires, I really don't want to be out here after it rains because that's how it is. But lots of holes. So, what are my final thoughts on this? Well, it's heavy duty. It really is. Um, I was originally using a hand one. I would rent it from Home Depot. I'd throw it in the back of my truck. It'd be hundred and something dollars and I do that twice a year now this I don't remember exactly what I paid for it and prices will vary so check out their website or give them a call um, but in the long run if you plan to keep aerating your lawn every year it's gonna make you money um, or at least save you money so Cat 1 or Cat 2, quick hitch compatible. You saw I had a little trouble with that one, um, but ultimately it clicked in, no problem. Parking stands, I got it up on wood for the winter. So this will be the last time I use it. Replaceable tines. It's heavy duty, it works. It does what I need it to do. Not much more I can ask for. This is the second attachment I've gotten from them. Um, I usually call them and they are fantastic to work with. They actually recommended this size for my size tractor. Um, if you have a smaller tractor, they have smaller ones. Like I said before, you can't turn with this. You need the independent tines um, if you want to, if you have a smaller yard or you want to turn with it. This one's for bigger, straighter land. The ones with the independent tines are almost double the price though. That's why I went with this one um, for what I'm going to use for it. It just works. That's really all I can say. Thanks for watching. This has been Tim with Adventures with Tim. Have a good one. See you in the next adventure.